Good morning, friends. Here we are getting deeper into Eastertide. And this Sunday, we're going to be exploring the book of Acts. And the Acts really represents the Easter church. So maybe that's a good follow-up. What, what did this burgeoning movement that was kind of centered around resurrection faith, what did it begin to look like? And who were some of the major players? Well, Actually, Sunday won't be one of the major players. Most of the sermons that come from Acts, it'll be Martyr Stephen or Paul or Peter or Silas. But we're going to look at uh, one of the one of my favorite um, figures in the book of Acts. He actually became the twelfth apostle um, after Judas's suicide and death, and his name was Barnabas. Actually, his name was Joseph, and like so many people in the New Testament, he took on a new name interesting name, Barnabas. In Hebrew, it means son of encouragement. So here he was, often kind of working, not the drum major leading the parade, not center stage, often working behind the scenes, filling the gaps. But one thing he always was there with and for, and that was this um, spirit of encouragement and affirmation. We'll see him at work, even helping Paul uh, deal with some of Paul's impatience and taking on young John Mark. I believe that what we'll be talking about Sunday plays into the power of human speech, particularly speech that is filled with the Spirit and with the very voice of Christ. So come and worship with us. We will have wonderful offerings from our youth choir and from our Chancellor Choir. And uh, I want to announce um, a couple of things that are, are going to be just very important. Number one, real thanks to Morgan, who has been with us um, as our interim youth minister. Beyond that, you have all welcomed her as one of our leaders in worship, offering prayers and call to worship. And last week, so effectively leading us um, and bringing the word. So thank you to Morgan for her service. Then um, I want to introduce to you uh, someone else that's going to be coming, a new member of our minister, ministerial staff, Caroline Camp, recent graduate of Duke, um, grew up in the Greensboro area, and she is going to be coming and working in youth ministry, but also uh, filling some other roles. Uh, she's very excited about what she has learned about Central Church, number of people from youth parents to the staff parish committee have had a chance to get to know her. She'll be coming and being with us really as Mary comes. The two of them will be both joining our staff in July. So thank you for um, all the wonderful outpourings and expressions of generosity, um, the way you continue to serve and to give and to keep ch Central Church um, moving into the future. I look forward to worshiping, worshiping with you all this Sunday. God bless you.